guys, welcome to another Minecraft video. Video. <laughs> um. So here I am in the prison yet again, and I am in the process of actually. I'll show you what I've got, what I've got done actually. It's not all that much from last time. Here's the front part of it. I've gone with the fencing for the cell windows. Might change these to iron doors depending on how much iron I have lying around the place. Around here then I might go with this system. Um, if you want this one, uh, I don't know, say in the comment box below or something. Or if you want this system put it in the comment box below so if you want this one say fences and uh, fences get the most thumbs up I'll do that one and then if we want this one just put walls or something like that and if that gets the most thumbs up I'll use that one personally I kind of like this one here now what I could do is I could put like a sticky little excuse me a sticky piston in there with a a bit of fence on it and then that will like open it and close it and stuff like that um, while we're here we as well take use of the bed <laughs> i'm a convict for a night Woo go me so anyway, yeah that would be your piston there and um, well a bit lower than that actually it would be in the block below that one there and then you type your fence sticking on there like that and then when you switch it on it will come up to about this way and then you wouldn't be able to get in there out but there would be a gap there how would you have fixed that gap well, I have no idea but you know you can do it that way like I personally kind of like this one as opposed to this one here that's just my taste anyway so here's the end bits that I was telling you about where it didn't exactly match up right but you know I'll do it now I'm doing the middle part in here which will be the I don't know what you call it in the prison but it's more like a small courtyard or something I don't know these are going to be stairs debating whether I'll use wooden ones or cobblestone ones cobblestone is easier to get but it looks ugly when you make it stairs out um, I think Notch probably in the next update, um, well not the next one because he's pretty busy with the next one, the 1 1.8, but the one after that I think Notch should make it so that, um, damn it. he should make it so that the, every block in the game can make uh, equal, equal things, so for example if I want to make golden stairs out of blocks I should be able to do that. If I want to make diamond ones, I should be able to do that. If I want to make golden fences, I should also be able to do that. <laughs> you see what I'm getting at? Um, for every block type, you should be able to do everything that you can do in the game. It's just a matter of how hard it is to get the block type. Now, obviously, you're not going to make diamond fences, but if somebody got enough diamond, they could do that. I think that would be a really, really good idea. Because he kind of done it with the swords and stuff like that, so why not do it with like items and stuff that you, well, craftable items. Be pretty good. Anyway, yeah, I'm just putting on the second layer here. I don't think it's going to be a very high prison. Well, I mean, very high floor, excuse me. I normally go about four high mm, just random sheep you got any shares in that's just typical isn't it yes this is still the water the hacked water tile as you all call it and officially gone there you go destroyed never to be found again and um, some people asked why I didn't just get rid of it or destroy it when I first I uh, got it and like I said in the video if you were listening at that time, uh, I was busy 
talking to my friend on Skype while on the server. Uh, my server, that is, personal server. While I was showing him around the world and stuff like that. But um, yeah, some drama kicked off on our actual public server, the Minecraft FTW server, so I had to kind of leave in a hurry. So I didn't get time to actually destroy the thing. But you know, like everybody's been saying lately, all the support that I've been getting anyway. Um, saying if I did hack, which I don't, but if I did, you know, they would support me and not to be, you know, playing into the hands of the trolls and stuff like that. They're completely right. 90% of the time, I would just ignore a troll anyway. <laughs> yes, you really are the black sheep of the family now, aren't you? So yeah, normally I just ignore the trolls completely and don't even give them attention. Which is why I've had to block a couple of people. Um, but you know, I've never done that ever in any of the videos, but this was called for because they were just spamming the video, so... You know, no more will be said about it. It's done and dusted. Uh. I hate when you're building and you have a fluent motion going and then like your mouse or something starts getting laggy or it doesn't feel right or that kind of thing. It kind of puts you off your building then and in turn then it kind of makes you not build so well. I don't know, that's probably just me. Okay. And you're ready. Whee! We pick up the hacked water tile now or something, you see. Or not. I'm not gonna call it a hacked water tile because it wasn't hacked, it was spawned. Don't I have a boat or something around? Oh, it's up there. <sighs> Typical. Uh, not sh if you're going to put sprinting in the game, but in at least swimming speed swimming or something, I don't know, so you can move a bit quicker in the water. Like, I don't know, click or something and you... I don't know, you go under the water like this or something and you swim with both your hands, I don't know. So <laughs> something like that. I actually can't wait to see how the sprinting is going to work on this critical system in 1.8. That's kind of piqued my interest, because apparently if you jump down and hit something just at the right time, you do critical damage to it. Now, if that's gonna work the way I think it's gonna work, everybody is gonna get a master at critical damage. And let me explain why. Because everybody that I know loves to jump in Minecraft. In fact, when some people are just walking in a straight line, they're jumping all the time. So, they've pretty much, <laughs> they've pretty much mastered the art of jumping already. So, uh, a bit of a click here and there, that that won't take too much mastering. And yeah, you're going to be able to do critical damage and stuff like that. Now, it'll be interesting when you're coming up against a creeper. Or maybe even the new... Um, I keep forgetting its name. But the new mob, anyway, that's coming into it. Um, it it's going to be interesting to see how... Uh, you're gonna like do critical damage to like creepers and stuff like that because let's face it, the creeper's gonna blow up in your face before you even get anywhere near damaging the thing. And then with the new mob thing that's coming in, when like you stare at them and stuff like that, what's gonna happen there? That's that's what I want to know because when he's standing there looking at you, if you jump at him or go to attack him, what will he do? Will you like just stand there and let you kick the crap out of him because you didn't look away? <laughs> I don't know. It's just it's gonna be interesting anyway. Be it's gonna be an interesting update. You know, a lot of people lately, especially in the uh, video I did about um, X David, um, popular YouTuber. Who still think I'm hating on him for some reason, even though I specifically said in the video that I'm not hating on the guy. But anyway, um, yeah, it, they love bringing up the fact that like 
um, in the new update coming out that it's an adventure update. I know it's an adventure update. Um, Notch wants to bring more to the game now. Now, does that mean that David was right all along? No. Definitely not. It just means that Notch wants to bring the game further than what it currently is. So if that means adding an adventure part to it or something like that, you know, he's perfectly entitled to do so. Okay. Put that in there, put that in there. Where is that other post on there? We don't need that, 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 that. Oh, no, wait, I mean, might need that. Don't need that, don't need that, don't need that. We don't need that. No. Yeah. Mm. Well, we have some arrows, so yeah, we'll take that. Lately, I'm getting very untidy with my treasure chests. I just tend to dump everything into the, the one treasure chest, and you know. <laughs> you, wait, look at this one. mess. <laughs> that's that's a bad habit to have. I should really get out of that. I used to be all night and tidy. Tidy? Night, night, night and tidy. What? Nice and tidy. There we go. <laughs> Why are we out here? We might as well kill some random cows. Yeah, so, anyway guys, um, I didn't really get much done with the prison, I do apologise for that because I've been kind of busy over the last day or two. So, pretty much what you've seen me get done here now today is pretty much all I've really had time to get done, so, um, over the weekend now I should get like a fair bit done, so that's going to be interesting. And I'm still, I really, I just, right now, I want to just stop doing the prison and go and do that mob trap. Because I love, I love designing mob traps and I love trying to get the maximum amount of resources that you can get out of the mobs without actually doing any work. <laughs> so, uh, anyway guys, I'm going to chop the video off here. I'm going to carry on with the prison and stuff like that, so. Until the next video. I shall see you all later. Uh, bye bye.